Good evening. It is the time for daily Vietnam news on Monday, the 26th of September 2022 from Vietnam Manual. USD reaches new peak against VND, storm Noru to approach central Vietnam with 166 km per hour winds. Exhibition shows Hanoi street vendors from a bygone era in Ho Chi Minh City in November and Vietnam travel guide today about Terrace Rice Field in the north are headlines today. The US dollar has risen to a new peak against the Vietnamese dong at nearly 23,900 Vietnamese dongs Monday, having gained 4.1% this year. Vietcombank hiked the rate by 0.1% from the weekend to 23,870 Vietnamese dongs. This means the state-owned lender has raised its rate by 0.85% within two weeks and 4.1% from the beginning of the year. BIDV increased the rate by 0.06% to 23,865 Vietnamese dongs. The central bank fixed the rate at 23,334 Vietnamese dongs, up 0.8% from the beginning of the year. Storm Noru, one of the strongest storms in 20 years entered the East Sea early Monday and is setting course for Da Nang and its central region neighbors. The storm was 810 kilometers away from Vietnam's Hoang Sa, Paracel, Archipelago at 4 a.m. Monday, carrying winds of 118 to 149 kilometers per hour. It is set to be 410 kilometers away from the archipelago at 10 p.m. Monday, and will move at speed of 20 to 25 kilometers per hour Tuesday, boosted by passing through a warm sea region according to the National Center for Hydrometeorological Forecasting. By Tuesday evening its wind speed could reach 166 km per hour, and will continue to move west and maintain that strength when it is around 170 km from the central region, from Da Nang southward to Binh Dinh Province, at 4 a.m. Wednesday. The Japan Meteorological Station and the Hong Kong Weather Forecasting Agency also forecast the storm will hit Da Nang and its southern neighbor Quang Nam home to Hoian, Wednesday morning. Central localities from Quang Binh to Binh Thuan are reviewing a plan to evacuate over 860,000 residents. Noru is the fourth storm to enter the East Sea, known as South China Sea internationally, this year and is likely to be the strongest so far. The storm is said to be similar to Storm Zhangzhan which hit central Vietnam in September 2006, leaving 76 people dead and missing nearly 350,000 houses and 1,000 vessels sunk or damaged. Black and white photos by French photographers of street vendors in Hanoi in the mid-20th century offer a glimpse into a lifestyle whose vestiges were to be seen until recently. The photo is one of more than 20 works exhibited at an exhibition, Gan Hang Rong, Street Vendor Shoulder Pole, organized by the French Institute in Vietnam and the Institute of the Far East, EFEO from September 23 to November 5 at Institute of Cultural Exchange with France, IDCAF, in HCMC's District 1. The exhibition displays photographs taken 1930 to 1950 by French photographers during their trips to Vietnam at that time. If talking about the most beautiful landscapes in Vietnam, you cannot bypass stunning rice terraces lying on superb mountains of Vietnam. The time at end of September and early October is the most wonderful for travelers to discover this landscape when all rice field is yellow. With hundreds year experience in rice production, Vietnamese farmers, especially ones who live in the northern mountain region, learned how to adapt to different terrains. Therefore, Rice Terraces Vietnam were formed a long time ago and is known as a unique culture and famous tourist attraction as well which anyone visiting Vietnam cannot miss. In Vietnam, there are many rice terraces and top three from them we recommend. Hoang Su Phi, Mu Kang Chai and Sapa. Rice Terraces Hoang Su Phi is known as the most beautiful one in Vietnam with bright yellow and majestic mountains. It is located in six communes, Ban Luoc, San Sa, Ban Phung, Ho Thao, Nam Thai of Xin Man District, Ha Giang Province. The best ones is in Ban Luoc and Ban Phung Commune. Standing in the center of Ban Phung Province, travelers can see the panorama of terraced rice fields with colorful stairs stretching from top of mountain to the small stream. Mu Kang Chai is an upland district of Yen Bai Province which is 280 kilometers, a promix at Li 180 miles, from Hanoi capital. 
The district is famous for 500 hectares of magnificent rice terraces located in La Pantan, Che Cunha and Deschu Commune. The terraced field is recognized as a national vestige and also one of the most unique tourist attraction in Vietnam. Sapa is not only famous for the highest mountainous town in Vietnam or the picturesque town in Mist, but also the stunning rice terraces named Ta Van, Hao Thao, Lao Chai among Muang Hoa Valley. It is the biggest terraced field community in Sapa with 1,000 hectares in area. Besides, the district possesses the rice terrace having the most stair with 121 ones. That is all for Vietnam news today. To update daily news from Vietnam Manual Channel, subscribe our channel. Thank you.